is the Drury Inn on Hotel Plaza Boulevard. This is our room at the Drury Inn on Hotel Plaza Boulevard. It's got a coffee maker, a microwave, and a refrigerator, an extra sink with a mirror, a bathroom with a toilet, a shower, and another sink. Also a desk, a table with some chairs, a bed, and a goo. We're staying at this newly opened resort for one night tonight to bring you guys along and show you what seems to be another affordable option right here next to Disney where you get quite a few benefits. What do you think, Goo? Goo's looking at the menu. You can actually order food to be, they don't deliver it to you, but you can pick Honestly, it up. Honestly, I'm, I'm shooken with shock here because this is this is very much a premium hotel. It seems premium, yeah. Um, you have food downstairs, you have an arcade. Yeah, yeah. This is great. Isn't there a Pizza Hut? There's a, there's a there's Pizza, a pizza hut, hut, a Starbucks, um, free, pretty, pretty much free dinner. Yeah. Uh, well, it's a 530 turnover. We're not exactly sure what it's going to look like. We'll show know. that to you guys. Free breakfast for sure. Yeah. And they also gave us a ticket that has three free drinks for each of us. Wait a minute. This is incredible. When we checked in, they gave us this welcome guide. Yeah, yeah. With the, the Disney Springs on it, and there's a bunch of coupons for Disney Springs. Mm -hmm. So you get coupons for Disney Springs. We get drinks, alcoholic yeah. drinks. Three, three each day. Yeah, which is crazy. And honestly, I mean, since you are staying on property, you get to enter the park 30 minutes earlier, too. So we get early park admission. And I think this room was only like $130, mm -hmm. which is kind of crazy to me. Oh, so. They do give pass holder discounts, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is honestly, truly, I am shook in the shock. But this is going to be great. I'm really excited. That being said, it's currently 3.32. I think Matt is getting kind of hangry. I am. Yeah. We haven't eaten anything today. Not to make it worse, they put this delicious looking taco yeah, in yeah. the middle of my table here. So honestly, I think we're going to try this out. This is their kitchen plus bar. Yeah. I don't know what that equals. Maybe it equals deliciousness. I guess so. The formula for a great oh, meal. I didn't realize there's a menu on the back. Oh, there's a menu there. Yeah. That's great. There you go. But you can scan that QR yeah. code. Show it It'll take bit. you straight to it. You can see everything they have. Yeah, but we actually ordered something there. So we're going to go downstairs. We're going to explore the hotel a little bit. And of course, nourish ourselves. Yeah. So, that's the priority here. Look at that view too. Look, they've gotten the highest guest satisfaction 16 years in a row. I guess it was so good they gave it retroactive. Well, yeah, for the last it's been open years. for like two days. <laughs> yeah. So 16 years out of two days, that must be pretty much an honor. There you go. Yeah, the lakeside bar and grill. I like the little Santa Claus there. Food, you ready to head back up, dude? I guess go so. eat in the room. I think that's best. Also, while we are down here, if you do want to go to any Disney World things, you have to schedule a shuttle. Oh, that's true. So you yeah. scan the barcode and then you schedule last three, two hours in advance. Mm. So that, that's that's probably the biggest like um, flexibility thing. Here we go. Lunch with a view of a hotel that looks kind of like the contemporary. So we're gonna pretend that it's a view of it's the like contemporary. It's like the Polynesian. <laughs> it is, yeah. Wherever. On the Grand, Grand Floridian or whatever. Oh, this is yours. Ooh. You got a quesadilla, right? Yeah. Huh? Quesadilla shrimp. with shrimp and some kind of chilies in it. Oh, it looks good. Oh, you got tachos. Wow. Yeah. I, I will say this is $12. This is a smaller portion. It is, yeah, yeah. But I think it was an appetizer, though. Oh, well, we'll see if it lives up. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty good. Well, it looks like you ate. What yeah, do you think? I liked it. I thought yeah. mine was really good. It was fresh. It was good. I had the tachos and they were fine. They weren't yeah. anything special, but they were good. Tiny portion. Tiny. Yeah, very tiny. Yeah. But honestly, I feel like the quality is good here. I feel like this is definitely kind of impressive. When I hear Drury Inn, I don't really have experience here. And I always just think it's kind of like one of those cheap hotels. Yeah. But this is pretty nice. Yeah, it's decent for the price especially, yeah. But that being said, it is getting a little bit later. I think we're going to kind of explore the resort a little bit, kind of enjoy a little bit more of the amenities here. And then at 5.30, we have to go for their, what do they call it, like a turn Like back? a turn down, turn, turn down, back or whatever. something. I don't know. I don't know. Either way, from what I understand, essentially what it is is free dinner. So, of yeah. course, we're going to go to it. We're yeah. going to eat. We're going to enjoy it. But we'll, we'll definitely check it out. We're going to enjoy the resort a little bit, and we'll go from there. <laughs> We decided to make a stop on the second floor on our way down to the first to check it out, see what we find up here. Look at this mural. This is kind of interesting. What do you think? 
I feel like I'm in the wilderness. This I guess so, yeah, in the jungle. Yeah, wow. The art there to match it. Yeah, yeah. But apparently on this floor is also where they do the breakfast and yeah. also the dinner thing. So I don't really know what's happening here. Looks like over in this direction there's a fitness center and I think that's gonna be more rooms, but they're not open yet. It looks like there's actually no one in here right now. So I could probably go on and take a look. There's like no one staying in this room. Yeah, very few people staying here. This is pretty decent. You have some bikes, you have some of those walking things, whatever they are, some treadmills, a couple different weights. Oh look, they have yoga mats. You wanna do some yoga? How do you even do yoga? Don't, don't, I don't need know. yoga. You use the mat. Okay, well you have a water bottle filler. You do? Yeah, that's kinda nice. But I will say, even here, they're not really done with furniture. It's still yeah, being renovated. Yeah, part in their pixie dust. So, uh, it, it, it seems like they did open a little bit earlier here. I feel like there are some things still being worked on. But everything but, for us, I yeah, think. Yeah, everything for us at least. Yeah, everything that like, we could want is open. Yeah. Kinda smells like popcorn on this floor. And there's an empty popcorn machine. So for the next, um... Oh, look there. Oh, popcorn. There's a little self-serve station here. Is this like kettle corn? Well, it kind of looks like it, I don't know. This, this is incredible. Yeah. If this is included... Yeah. So I guess you just get your scoop. Just like that. There you go, if you want to put some salt or whatever. Yeah. There you go. It's good popcorn. There you go. This is incredible. I feel like there's so many fun things. And look at this. Yeah, this is a good size. Nice like stuff in here. For breakfast, I was thinking it was going to be like a small little... Most hotels just has like a small area off the lobby. Mm -hmm. This is like a food court. Yeah, This yeah. is crazy. I'm honestly really, really curious to see what dinner looks like. If mm -hmm. it's a full dinner, but this is great. Well, I think that's pretty much everything on this floor for now. We will be back here a little bit later. But I think at this point, we're going to head down to the first floor, take a little look around. And because I have a feeling that won't be Goo's last bag of popcorn this trip, we might have to take the stairs. Thanks. I like this picture. I wish they sold some of these out by that for the apartment. They don't have a gift shop here. No, yeah. Unfortunately. Free popcorn, though. This is great. And actually, immediately, once you go down these stairs, to both of our surprise here, we have a giant tree. Yeah. And it's very... It's sticking out. Oh, look. Oh, no, it's, oh, no, it's an elf. elf. Oh, it's the elf on the shelf. The elf on the shelf is... He's watching over us. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is great. I feel like the lobby here is just... It's it's definitely nice. At least for what I would expect for, like, a nicer resort around here. You have plenty of seating here because, actually, that's the kitchen and bar, like, their main restaurant. And they actually have, like, a little to-go window, like a grab-and-go area over here, too. So, lots of really good options. I feel like this is definitely more condensed into one area. Yeah, I feel. But I feel like this is this is great. Mm -hmm. And here's a little look at the marketplace. And look, they even have, like, a Starbucks machine, too. Oh, this is very so you can make, like, Starbucks espresso, their exact yeah, beans right. there. Huh. What do you think? Do you Kinda. think it tastes as good? I don't know. Maybe we'll have to try it tomorrow. Yeah. I think they do do this later in the evening. You can actually get pizzas here like i guess pizza hut pizzas to go so you just grab them and go go them i guess but pretty much any kind of snacks yeah all these snacks here pretty much all these things you could ever need for your room look pop tart bites <laughs> mini pop tarts i guess maybe you should try those frosted strawberry though if they had a better flavor oh you don't like strawberry no i feel like at this point they're just mocking me I don't know, they might be good. Maybe that looks terrible. They look kind of good. Super crunchy. Oh, that sounds good. That's that's horrifying. And the rooms do have microwaves, so you have all kinds of different microwave meals as well. If you want a more simple meal here, and then you have some like freezer ice cream, you're gonna get anything. Not right now, but I'll have to come back and get some orange juice for tomorrow morning. Are those dipping dots? Oh, this is incredible. You see that? Dippin' Dots? They have Dippin' Dots. Yeah, they do. I feel like the Dippin' Dots just made this a premium experience for me. Yeah. And this, this is great. I also really do love how there's so many like different amenities here. There's computers you can use, there's printers you can use, so if you need to like print a boarding pass or anything. And immediately Matt's running straight to the arcade. Where else would you go? I, I'm not blaming you, I'm, I'm going with you. But this is pretty great here, let's, let's go in here. It's, it's... The lights are pulsing out of here. And there's nobody here. Yeah. What do you think? It's nice. They have some good stuff. But if you do want to play games, you just go here and you buy your car. It's that simple. Yeah, yeah. This I don't know great. how much stuff costs. Yeah. 
So 30 credits was $5. Yeah. And like this game here, this is six credits. So that's six credits for this. Yeah, so you so could play you, that. $5 could get you a long way. Yeah, you like, could play that five times. You want to do it? No. See, Matt's not very fun. No, I'm not. You want to tell him who won you? You want to tell him? Why do I have to tell them you? I don't know. I won. That's right. I think really the only other thing to show that we haven't shown yet is this outside area. What do you think, Goo? There's a nice pool. There's some good seating yeah, out here. There's a lot of seating. I yeah. feel like, at least now, half the hotel is not open. I think one of the towers is currently still under construction. Mm -hmm. But like, nobody's here. There's a lot of seating. There's a pool bar there. There's a splash area over there. Yeah, and then yeah. there's a really great pool. This yeah. Is huge. yeah, yeah, it's really nice. This reminds me of the Swan Reserve, like I said earlier. I feel like it. it's a nice pool. It's a nice area out here. Honestly, it's just nice. I like this. One kind of strange thing is the pool bar is only open until 7 p.m. That being said, the bar inside is open, I think, until 11. So you won't be able to come out here and get a drink, but you'll just have to go right inside those doors. But well, here's another look at their pool. They call it a resort-style pool. Yeah. So I don't know. Does it... Does it Make you think of a style of a resort? I guess so. I like those little cabana things there. Yeah. Oh, should we go check them out? Maybe we should, yeah. Here we go. Ah. Well, these are nice. This is comfortable. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I like this a lot. So it's like Swan Reserve, but you don't have to pay for the cabanas. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is really nice. You look like you're sitting on a throne. Yeah, it feels like it. This is great. And honestly, it's kind of cool. The water kind of ends right along the gate here. So you actually have like a view of like the whole lake right there. The sun is setting. It's a very beautiful shot here. But honestly, this is just great. I really love this area. I, I feel like this hotel, if, if anything, it's just very simple. It's nice. So yeah, this is great. Well, at this point, it's around 530 and they're actually starting their like their turn back or turn, turn down or, or whatever, whatever the food is. thing is. Yeah. yeah. So we're gonna check it out. This is pretty exciting. As you can see, the sun is kind of setting a little bit too. And so is my appetite increasing. Oh, there we go, yeah. Yeah, but good thing they stole the popcorn out. That's good. It smells good, yeah, yeah. But I'm, I'm rushing to the food over here. So actually there's like three different stations and every single one has the same thing. Okay. But um, right here, you have some mixed vegetables. Mm -hmm. They look very mixed. They do, yeah. You got some mashed potatoes. Those look, those oh. actually look good. They look like Disney mashed potatoes. They do, yeah. I think the finale and also the biggest one and the most popular one. The meatballs. Meatballs and gravy. They look pretty good. I'm gonna get some. Honestly, this looks, I, it's not gonna be a full dinner. I don't know, maybe you guess you yeah, can make yeah. it a full dinner, but we'll try it out. Yeah. You also do have a little light salad bar here and some soup. Oh, it looks good. Oh, wow. I guess we'll just try this all out. I'm, I'm intrigued. What do you yeah, think? Yeah, it looks good. I do also like that they actually have drinks and you can pretty much just fill it up, get your drinks here. So I think this is definitely more of a meal. I was kind of expecting kind of like one of those appetizer things, or maybe they have like one or two things and just not very much, but th this is this is great. You got a meatball there. What'd you think? Oh, he's chewing. It's a meatball. It's a meatball, there you go. Yeah. They're like Ikea meatballs. Yeah, yeah. And the plates are kind of, I was thinking the plate is very reminiscent <laughs> of the fine Norwegian dining that you find at Ikea. I don't think it's Norwegian. Something like that. Swedish, I think. Oh, that's right. I, whatever it is. The, um, I, I'm very convinced with mashed potatoes. They literally just went to a Disney restaurant and got them off from there. Because these, these taste just like Disney mashed potatoes. They made a reservation at um, Chef Mickey. Yeah. And they just went and got the unlimited mashed potatoes and yeah. brought them over here. Well, they don't have the mashed potatoes at Chef Mickey anymore. Oh, that's Remember true. Yeah, like that's that. right. Yeah. <laughs> so they had to go to like um, Whispering Canyon. Don't they have it there? Right. Or no? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Somewhere on yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Have mashed potatoes. Nothing nothing life changing here, but this is really nice. If you're, if you're here and you want a snack, this is more than just a little appetizer. This is great. Yeah, yeah. Also, the sign over there indicates that there's going to be a bar on both sides, and we have our coupon with us to get a free drink. Actually, three free drinks if we want. Yeah. So, there you go. We'll have to take advantage of that when we're through eating our meatballs. We missed this whole section over here where they have, they have hot dogs, they have nachos, a good amount of toppings. This is pretty nice. I like this. You excited for a drink? Yeah, maybe a little. We found, it, um, we found the bar over here. We get three complimentary drinks. Per day on your stay. Yep. What'd you get, Goo? You got like a Coke and rum, I think? Yeah, yeah. 
Just there you simple. Go. Yeah. It, it's all included, so you get three per day. Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah. Go back up again and again. Yeah. Honestly, they had hot dogs, they had nachos. I, I feel like you could make a meal out of this, but if you just want to use it as a snack, you can, which is nice. I appreciate that. But this has been great. I think this is a pretty nice option here. Um, I'm honestly very, very impressed. I'm shooken with chalk. Yeah, yeah. What do you have to say? I think it was pretty good. Yeah. I like that I got a second drink here. It was like Sprite and grenadine and vodka and something else. I don't know. Yeah. That's good. That being said, though, I think we're going to kind of go up to the room. We might actually head to Disney Springs or somewhere, and we'll just kind of go from there. That being said, it looks like Matt is very lively. He's very nourished. He, yeah. he has like a whole night ahead of him. I think only, the food woke me up. Yeah, it's like 6 o'clock now. We have a whole night ahead of us. That being said, this hotel does not have a lot of transportation, but I think we're going to attempt to walk to Disney Springs. They do have transportation to Disney Springs, but you have to request it two hours in advance and all this yada yada. Yeah. So it's like a 20 minute walk. We're just yeah. going to walk. Yeah. There's sidewalks. We'll be good. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> but I think we'll switch the camera. We'll go downstairs and we'll, and we'll go from there. Switching camera now. Let's go. Okay. Well, we have officially made it here to Disney Springs. It really wasn't that bad of a walk. The ground was mostly even. It wasn't that super long. I think that was better than having to wait another two hours yeah. for a bus to come. Roughly 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah, not bad. But now that we are here, we're heading straight over to the world of Disney because today is the day that the merchandise was released for the 100th anniversary of Disney company, like the Disney Studio. And I think they're supposed to have it in stores. I don't know if they might have ran out or... I saw it. That it was at Magic Kingdom, so we'll see. Oh, gotcha. We'll go see. We'll find out. Hopefully it's there. And here it is. It looks like they have quite a bit of a spear jersey here. The lounge fly. Oh, that's got a nice look at the ears. I think they actually have some like that. I don't know if we'll see them today. They have some popcorn here with all the different colors for the 100th anniversary. Oh, look at this. That's pretty nice. Look, it's got the different characters on it. It's like a film strip there with all the different characters. That's kind of cool. But look, they only have smalls. There's some mediums there on the other side, but that's it. No big sizes. They also have this 100th anniversary pin. Look, it's got like one of these hanging things on it. That's kind of neat. On here, Goo is going to model the spirit jersey for us. Chose the back. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, there you go. Oh, look, it's got the characters on it. It's kind of nice. There you go. I'm not sure if they just didn't have the ears or if they ran out of them. I could definitely see that being one of the more popular items. So I wouldn't be surprised. Did you see this 2022 line of merchandise? Oh, no, that's kind of neat, too. It's kind of retro. Oh, I like this mirror. Look at that. It's like an old TV. That's kind of cool. I don't know what kind of picture would fit in that though. The ornament as well. That's nice. They even have a soap bottle. Soap bottle. So what's the? Is it just Mickey or is yeah, it different? Mickey. Okay. But it's still it's nice. Yeah. Nice. Huh. Oh, that is nice. Yeah. yeah. And I will say these are no price. Yeah. They're free. Oh, wait, wait. Twenty dollars. Uh, Twenty dollars. There you go. That's Twenty dollars. Look at the lunch box. Oh, I like. Oh man, I'm gonna get that. <laughs> How much is it? Um, thirty dollars. That's not bad. This is 2023 okay. on it. I'm getting that. And it's a lunch box. Mine. <laughs> and then also a plush banner. That's kind of nice too. This is. I will not say, bad. every year their dated merchandise is exactly the same. Yeah, yeah. I, I love this. Movie. This so far, this is my favorite year's merchandise. And I have some Nutcracker stilt walkers here too. Should I go get a picture with them? Maybe you should. I hope you can get pictures with them. You can Gosh. Talk to them. That's original. Yeah, that's great. Honestly, Disney Springs is just full of festive cheer. You have the trees, you have the stilt walkers. How much more Christmas can you get here? This I is don't crazy. know. It's crazy. What's up with this? Mm -hmm. oh, this is Look, there's like festive. They're like snowflake people. to think about that. Yeah, that was weird. It's snowing. You see the snow? This is amazing. Wow. Are you going to answer the call? No. No? I've answered it too many times. I'm ready for uh, them to stop calling. Oh. That snowflake person almost killed me. But 
to end our night on a more festive note, we're gonna be getting something from Ghirardelli here. Yeah, yeah. this is exciting. You're gonna get Knob Hill chill. I don't know what I'm gonna get. I just want like a brownie sundae or something. But... Yeah. But we have succeeded and officially ordered. Yeah. Are you excited? I'm excited, yeah. I got like a brownie sundae, I think. You got a cup of ice cream. This will be good. Yeah. Did you have a good time, Goo? Yeah. Um, I'm honestly really tired. We've had a really busy week. And honestly, the excitement is getting too much here tonight. What do you yeah. think? Yeah, it, it's pretty exciting, but My I think I'm great. ready. Yeah, it was really good, good yeah. finale. Mm -hmm. That being said, though, I think we're going to head back to our hotel, kind of calm down for the night, and we'll just kind of go from there. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're back to the room. It's actually the next morning. We got back from Disney Springs. We went straight to bed. Are you tired? I'm a little bit tired, but... We still have one more thing to do here before we leave. That is to experience the biggest and most anticipated part of the Jewelry Inn. That is the breakfast. Everyone keeps telling me that the breakfast is always like the biggest thing here. So honestly, the expectations are high. We're gonna see what happens. And I think we're gonna go down and check it out. So we thought breakfast ended at 10. Apparently that's only on the weekends. It ends at 9.30 today. It is 9.15. You ready for breakfast, Goo? I don't like breakfast. No. Second. I like it. Four. So we have biscuits, gravy, breakfast potatoes. And I think this is sausage, yeah. Sausage patties. Also some oatmeal and some pancakes over here. Bacon and cheddar scramble, that sounds good. I tried the potatoes, they're not bad. This sausage looks kinda, oh, kinda suspicious. What do you think, dude? Put it between the biscuit. Bacon oh. sandwich. Oh yeah, maybe. There you go. Doesn't look as bad. And they did have some stuff up there too. They had like, um, Salsa and cheese and different things that you could put on it. I think I'm trying is essentially bad. It's just a simple breakfast. I feel like it's exactly what I expected. I'm not gonna complain if you are coming here, you're getting a simple breakfast and I feel like it is fulfilling. So there you go, I got my apple juice. I'm starting to wake up a little bit more. This is great. That being said, I think we're done with breakfast. I think we're gonna head down to the room, kind of clean things up and we'll go from there. It's been crazy though how like low the crowds have been. Mm -hmm. There's like no one at anywhere here. I, I feel like, I know like one of the towers is still under construction, but this is kind of crazy. It's been a really interesting stay here. That being said, it looks like Matt made a mess around here. He has a lot to clean up here before we leave. All this stuff is yours. Are you ready? I'm ready. Well, I think that concludes our stay here at the Drury Inn. I think so. What do you think? It was nice. I liked it, especially for the price. I think the room was definitely nicer than what was at the All-Star Sports where we paid like the same price. We paid more. I've so, seen yeah. All-Star Sports go up to like $300 sometimes mm -hmm. too. Yeah. Um, this room, we had a discount, but this room was $150 after tax. Mm -hmm. um, generally, I've seen it at this price and even lower yeah. for normal rates too. So. I feel like this is a pretty good deal. You're getting the breakfast, you're getting the dinner. Honestly, it's just what you make of it, so. Yeah. Yeah. But that being said, I think that concludes our stay here at the Drury Inn. I think it's been a really great stay. I'm glad we got to bring you guys along, and this has been great. Yeah. It's always fun to come right to these resorts when they open, and I think it's really a unique opportunity to check out all these, like, local good neighbor hotels. Mm. So if there's any other hotels around the area you guys want us to check out that are not Disney, please feel free to let us know in the comments, and that would be great. Yep. But yeah, thank you guys so much for joining us. Make sure you guys do hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And yeah, that'd be great. But as usual, I'm Goo. I'm Matt. And you're you. And we both wish a Goo to each and every one of you. Hope you all have a great day. Thanks for coming along. We'll see you guys later.